No full starts. Away they go. Todd Bennett flying. But he's got David Clark, who's also gone off quickly. And David Clark's already... Darren Clark has opened up. A bit of a lead on Todd Bennett and has closed on Kip Kenboy. Darren Clark going the better at the moment. In lane four, Samson Couture in the all-red of Kenya is having a good run and is closing on Todd Bennett. But it's Darren Clark at the moment. Darren Clark has chased down Kip Kenboy. Kip Kenboy senses he's there and goes again. Darren Clark gets after him. Darren Clark in lane six, Kip Kenboy in lane seven. And it really is a battle. Kip Kenboy going around and Darren Clark breaks away. Darren Clark for Australia coming up on his inside Kitter, but it's going to be Darren Clark, Darren Clark and then Kia Kitter, Kip Kenboy, and then Robert Stone is in fourth place. Todd Bennett failed badly over the last closing stages, but uh, a gallant run for him. He's made the final. 44-60 at last Charles Asati's record has gone. That's a lifetime best for Darren Clark. Always the bridesmaid now really has made him as the bride and he really had all the pressure because he had two very good Kenyans. 5-5-4 five, five, outside him, Simeon Kip Kenboy. Inside him, Samson Couture. Watch the two red vests close him down. But that's a tremendous time, 44-60. Charles Asadi's record going way back to 1970 and Australia make it a good day and get in the fourth place through Rob Stone. Darren Clark timed that beautifully. I think it's Couture that's going to get the silver. Kip Kimboy is going to get the bronze.